time now for the, for the, the medal ceremony for the women's 100 meter T37 final. And what a day it's been for Kadena Cox. In her heat in the morning, she broke the world record. 13.59 seconds. And she broke the world record in the morning session. And then out again in the afternoon. And Mandy Francois Ali, the defending champion who didn't get further than about 15 metres down the track before she fell over. That was her who also relinquished the world record earlier in the morning for Kadena Cox in a 1-2 for British Athletics. And Georgina Hermitage in second place, but a Russian who we've seen a fair few of in today's medal ceremonies. Anna Sabajnikova in 14.30 seconds. Winner of the silver medal. She had a PB this year of 13.85. So she didn't get up to that mark, but she still comes away with the bronze medal. And Georgina Hermitage, who was beaten into second place by Kadena Cox. A similar race in the heat in the morning session. 13.87 for her. 13.79, her best so far this year and a personal best. Gold medalist, She's content uh, with a silver medal. Another British athlete, Kadena Cox, representing Great Britain. who has had a Kadena stunning Cox. 24 hours to open these championships in Doha, now steps up to the podium and takes the gold medal. She only ran 0 0.01 of a second slower than she did by breaking the world record. So. The heat doesn't seem to bother her. She got out there, she did what she had to do. And I know in the morning session you were wondering whether she might tighten up a little bit when it came to the final, but it didn't Ladies happen, did it? Katina, oh, Katina right. Cox, just as good. I was quite worried after a big performance like that, you can come back and perform quite poorly in the afternoon. So one is nerves, two, you're tired. So it was good to see her come through and be able to execute her race again. Time now for the British National Anthem. Success and Kadena Cox. Four gold medals on the opening day.